like so excited. Come here. <laughs> okay. It is not super early, but it feels super early because we were up so late last night. These boys were late up, up late, and I was up late. We all slept so good. The boys slept in the room all night long and didn't die. come out. And they're so excited to find Fred. What? Let's see. Oh my gosh, he's a superhero. It says Scout Elf Superhero. Oh my gosh. And you want to see what this note says? The last few weeks have been tons of fun. You've made my job easy, and I'm sad it is done. Tonight I go back to give my report as Santa's list is ready to sort. Our time together has come to an end. Back to the North Pole, your elf you must send. Next year will arrive in the blink of an eye. Just watch for the magic and reindeer in the sky. He's going home, guys. This is it. We got to say bye to Fred tonight because he's... Bye, Fred. <laughs> Finn's like, bye, see ya. This is the last time we're going to find him this year. We'll have to wait till next year to find him again. Is that kind of sad? You guys going to miss finding Fred? Yeah. I'm going to miss him. I'm gonna miss you guys coming to my room and screaming, let's find Fred, let's find Fred! I think Fred's gonna give you a good report. You guys, what? There's, there's presents under the tree. Really? Yeah, I didn't put those out either. Oh my gosh. Are they for us? They're for us and they're from Fred. Fred? He must have wrapped these last night. It says, to uncle from Fred. That's to uncle from Fred. Don't open it, we can't open it right now. Let's see what this one is. <gasps> To Ollie from Fred. Is that so cool? Yeah. All right, I think that is so fun. Let's um, open these tonight, okay? Okay. I can't believe Fred wrapped presents and put them under the tree for us. These boys are like obsessed with their new toys. Well, yeah. All right, let's eat some breakfast. It's time for a random Christmas dance party. Here we go. We are just having a blast today. We're all ready for our day. We actually are looking a little fancier today, aren't we? Yeah. <laughs> it's Christmas Eve, so I like to dress up a little bit. Although I also like just staying in my pajamas on Christmas Eve too, but I kind of was in the mood to like get a little bit dressier. And we've been talking all morning about how Santa Claus is coming tonight. Yeah. Woo! Finn, have you been a good boy? He's like, I don't want to talk about it. <laughs> oh yeah, they just are really obsessed with showing you guys friends. <laughs> you know, today is like such a magical day. I don't know why I'm like so excited. I feel like I haven't felt like this since I was a kid and I think it's because I have two kids that are both like so excited and I can just see the magic in their eyes and it like it makes me want to cry every time I like see it. Like it just, oh, it's so intense and I love it. I love Christmas and I've got, I think what's cool is that all, this is the first year Ollie really, really, truly understands what's going on and Finn in a way understands better than Ollie ever did because he has an older brother to kind of like be excited and tell Finn like it's, we have to be excited. And so I have two kids that are just so so, so excited for Santa to come, huh? Mm -hmm. All right, we've been doing a lot of cleaning, and I still have an entire kitchen to clean, so I'm gonna do that now. Merry Christmas Eve, you guys. Oh I am catching up on much needed Christmas wrapping. And I just gotta say, you guys, I, I feel like I'm an artsy dude. I studied art in college. I feel like I tend to be a more creative person, and I really enjoy gift wrapping. <laughs> And I don't know, I think I'm pretty good at it. What do you guys think? Am I pretty good? This one is to Missy from me, and um, I think she's definitely going to like this one. I just can't believe it's already Christmas Eve. There's so much excitement in the air, I feel like, in the house with the, with the boys, just because they're so young and it's so magical for them. So I'm really excited for tomorrow, for Christmas. Today's gonna be a lot of fun too, though. We're having like a little party with the family. Oh, but one thing that's also new, check out my Star Wars tattoo, you guys. <laughs> what do you think? I think it's just a good way to remind me that I'm always a rebel. I'm a rebel at heart. Yeah, I've never had tattoos, so this is my first, <laughs> and I like it. Do you believe in Santa? Of course. Who else would drive the sleigh? It's National Eggnog Day. Don't hesitate to drink some eggnog. Eggnog? Hmm? I don't, I, you know, I am 27 years old. I still don't know if I like eggnog. Do you like eggnog? 
Let me know down below in the comments and in the iCard poll above. I really want to see, do we actually like eggnog or is it more of a tradition thing? All right, the Hollister side of the family party has now started. We've got the Valix and Shaws and everyone and we've got delicious food again. We've got all these little appetizers Brian has been buying and they're so good, so easy to make and just like delicious. We've got tamales from Carlos's mom. We've got cheese and crackers and all kinds of sweets and we are just starting the party. We're so excited. Hey, are you guys excited? Yeah! Santa's almost here! Ah! <laughs> what? And I've got the all of the gingerbread house stuff set up. It's looking pretty professional now after. I gotta figure out how many years this has been. How many years has this been? I think it's like four or five. No, I think it's like six or seven. Yeah, and it's getting very um, professional. I've got little dishes out because normally we just like have bags torn open, candy spilled everywhere. This is kind of the adult table. I even have a kid's table. CJ and Bailey are gonna do theirs here and we've got these little ones for like Ollie and Finn and Olivia. It's gonna be so much fun. One of the cutest moments ever. You guys are amazing. Go play, have fun, oh my gosh. Even Finn was joining in. Gingerbread house contest is almost ready to begin. We get crazy around here, you guys. We got chairs from the outside. We got the piano bench. And we've got everyone with their kits and candy. You excited to design something cool, buddy? Yeah. Yeah? Are you gonna do one too, Finn? Yeah. Look at these shark gummies. You wanna try one? Try it. Can I try one? Sure. I'm, I'm gonna try it. Ugh, the guys are candy. They're so good. Really? Do you think they'll look cool on the gingerbread houses? I figure someone can do maybe like a what's it called? Like an aquarium, yeah. you know? are opening their presents and so excited. What'd you get? So cool. Bailey's like opening up our present that Ollie and Finn got that for you. <laughs> Finn, what did you just open? Oh my goodness, your brother's gonna love that too. Um, he just opened that and he literally was like, wow. <laughs> so cute, huh? Look at that, Ollie, look at that thing. All right, Finn, is this your gift? <laughs> Go for it, go for it. Uh, keep going, keep going. Aunt Linda. <gasps> What's that? That man. Oh my goodness. What do you say, Finn? Say thank you, Linda. Oh, what's in there? What is it? Whoa, a big old snake. Whoa. That'll be so cool in your guys' room, huh? Finn, say thank you, Linda. That's a big snake. I think snakes are a common uh, gift this year. I know. <laughs> I'm noticing them more. Ollie, you got Superman? Oh, and another, a Robotosaurus. Thank you, Aunt Linda. Thank you, Aunt Linda. <laughs> We've got sword fights happening over here. CJ. I, my mom said that I can put this on now. What is it? Makeup. Oh, you got a makeup kit? Yeah. That's awesome. Merry Christmas. <laughs> Look at this present I just got. It's got Jingle Bells on it. <laughs> oh, these are cute as 
like little ornaments. Oh, that's so cool. It is now time for the Christmas Saran Wrap ball game again. And everyone is so into it. It's so much fun. If you guys didn't watch us play this game yesterday, I'll have it linked in the iCard. Go watch yesterday's vlog so you can see it. Everyone's getting really into it. It's quite funny. You go ahead, Janet! <laughs> The annual gingerbread house building competition has begun and the stakes are high. The icing is firm. This is it. And that's a nice clean slate to start working with. Thank you. What if you did nothing and just went minimal? I still think I'd lose. You never know what the judges are looking for. Doing okay over there, CJ? <laughs> it happens. Oh, oh no. Extreme home makeover, Carlos. That's not true. Like I said, the stakes are high and tensions are high here at the annual Gingerbread House Building Competition 2017. Me and Ollie are working on our own gingerbread house. I know. We're making one for Santa, right? Yeah. Yeah. So cute. A lot of people are like almost done, and I'm like just starting. So I'm excited to see how they all turn out. This is a kids' table. Jessica's working on this, and this is an earthquake, a California earthquake before Christmas. <laughs> building contest. We have a ton of really awesome uh, houses right here. And we need your help to decide who wins this. Who takes home the So next I'm gonna show you all the pictures of the gingerbread houses that are actually in the running with the name of them. I'll have a poll in it. Don't vote until you've seen them all and then go through and vote for the one you want. So it'll say vote for this one or no vote. Make sure you wait for the one you want. It's up to you guys. We have a really big prize for the winner so Vote for the one you like, wait till you see them all, and let's do this. a wrap on the party we had so much fun we actually were able to get most of the house pretty clean because it was a disaster it's so bad, it so bad. <laughs> I'm like Christmas morning tomorrow my house can't look like this um, so everyone really helped and pitched in and um, it looks so much better and I did want to say the winner of the gingerbread contest after putting it up onto um, the insta story so if you're not following me on Instagram make sure you go see so you can see all the final results mine was terrible it was just falling apart it doesn't <laughs> did not work at all I think I had too much going on and I couldn't really like focus on it the winner was Cassie and Carlos it, it was only took me seven years yeah seven years to get it. <laughs> um she has never even come close to winning yeah. her house usually looks like um yeah. a little so crazy you guys, you guys want to know why it's <laughs> yes I think that they're a good team so anyways she won it was called the Candyland it was actually really really good but anyways yeah now we're actually gonna do some of our traditional Christmas Eve things and so I'm excited to get the night started <laughs> So these are our presents from Fred he left today because this is his last day. Open. Don't open any yet. We gotta wait. We're excited to see what he got us. Got 
everyone gifts. This one's Finn's. Oh, Uncle, this one's yours. That's Ollie's. Ooh, I get one too? All right, everyone open your presents. I wonder what's in them. I wonder what we all got. Fred got us some nice pajamas. Then what'd you get? <laughs> nice. Are they so cute. So they're onesies. Yeah, and then the back it says. <laughs> no peeking. No peeking <laughs> no at your Christmas presents early, okay, Ollie? Okay. <laughs> all right, now we all have to get in our pajamas, guys, and take our family pic. We gotta get in. With the, yes! with the new, with the new okay, dud. All right, you guys, I think we're gonna use some YouTube Christmas magic so that we can all change into our pajamas much faster, right? Yeah! Okay, on the count of three, go. everyone go ho, ho, ho. Those are the magic words, and we'll all have our pajamas on. Ready? Okay, let's do okay. it. One, two, three. Ho, ho, ho! Oh my gosh, I love these. What do you guys think of our onesies? <laughs> Everyone's so wearing together. matching Christmas jammies. Ooh, we look so cute. We're all matching. I honestly think these are my favorite. They're nice, they're thin. I think they're nice and thick. There's a lot of fleece online when you're oh, buying Christmas. Yeah. <laughs> I'm proud of all you guys for sporting this. We did good. <laughs> all right, boys. We gotta get our cookies out for Santa, huh? Is Santa gonna bring you presents today? <laughs> Have you been a good boy, though? No. <laughs> <laughs> At, least At least he's honest. Last night he was a little iffy. Tonight he's like, yes. Yeah. I'm just gonna, I was kind of bowing up today. to it. <laughs> All right, it's cookies hey, and milk time. Mama, did, look, did Santa like this milk? Yeah, this is organic milk, so I think he's gonna like it. So let's put some cookies on the plate for Santa. You do some chocolate chip. Did you want to do some of these pink ones too? Yeah. Maybe just like one or two, you know. I've heard he's a chocolate chip guy. Honestly. Yeah. And then Santa will eat your cookies, okay? okay. Good job. All right. We need milk. I'll, I'll pour it okay, you pour it in. How much milk do you think he needs? That's good. I think he's gonna love that, guys. Ah, stinky, stinky. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> no, it's what? Not. It's good. It's okay, good. I was like, we cannot give expired milk to Santa Claus, okay? That'll get us in trouble. That would not be good. All right, we are gonna put our cookies and milk for Santa under the Christmas cage. Oh, no, 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 no. We're gonna have to put the dogs away, so. Yeah, we are. Here's our Christmas cage. Directly underneath it will be cookies and milk. So maybe, boys, just maybe, we could actually catch Santa. Yeah. We have a song called Let's Catch Santa. We at least should try to catch him, right? We should try. Do you want to catch Santa, Finn? Yeah. All right, let's try, okay? Good night, Fred. It was so fun hanging out with you this year, bro. Bye, Fred. All right, we have some corn, and I think we should put it out for the reindeer, right? I think that's a good idea. I don't think we have anything else to give them, so Here maybe they'll eat some. Let's go see if we can see Santa in the sky. All right, we're going to see if we can spot him. Oh, there's a reindeer. <laughs> that's a, that's a okay, so oh, okay. we put this uh, How about right here on the fountain for the reindeers? No, no, no. You don't want him to see us? Santa won't, if Santa sees you awake, he just will wait until you're asleep, okay? <laughs> he's so afraid that Santa's gonna see him awake <laughs> and not come. Don't worry, if you see him, he'll he's just gonna circle around until you're in bed, okay? Don't Gotta get in bed or else Santa can't come, let's go! The children were nestled all snug in their beds while visions of sugar plums danced in their heads. And Mama in her kerchief and I in my cap had just settled down for a long winter's nap. Pipe he held tight in his teeth and the smoke, it encircled his head like a wreath. Can you not smoke in my house, Santa? That's inappropriate. I'm loving. Then if, if you wake up, then you need, you need to stay in your bed. But if you get out, then Santa will be, will, won't bring, Santa won't come. Then he won't bring you present, right, Mama? That's right, huh? Mama, no, Mama, no, <laughs> All right, boys, it's time for night. Okay, we gotta go sleep, okay? I love you guys.
All right, we are opening the last night of our advent calendars. We're getting ready to read Twas the Night Before Christmas, which does not have Jack Skellington in it. I have to remind Ollie that is nightmare for Christmas. <laughs> oh, I think all yours are done because you ripped them all out early, huh, Finn? Yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video, and I hope you guys had a very Merry Christmas. So excited for you to see our Christmas celebrations tomorrow. So be on the lookout for that. Thanks for watching, guys. We will see you manana. Who wants to do the bye boop? I'll say Merry Christmas, guys. Merry Christmas. <gasps> Is that Santa? Yeah. Say Santa. Merry Christmas, guys. We'll see you tomorrow. Say 